younger generation and these younger athletes coming up and they have zero fear at all and they're consistent i love hearing because i'm before you and i remember when you were a little person and i was like oh that's cute and then we were i think i was on a on a street course that had big obstacles and i remember thinking you're good you're technical you're very consistent especially for how small you are but there was something i can't remember what it was but you ollied over something where i was like <laughs> that's gigantic yeah. and and very dangerous and you were and, and as i thought you were fearless yeah that's what it takes i think that's what it takes right now is just to have like it's calculated you know right. you got to be calculated you can't just go out there willy-nilly and like go for it and not expect any consequences right. but if you long yeah if you're calculated with your risks in skateboarding it'll get you pretty far i so, watched the women's uh, skate street final today yeah and it was it was wild. I saw a 12-year-old 12 12 year girl front blunt, the, the, the 10 stair. That was her that. first trick. Yeah, I saw that. And then come back and kick flip back, back lip it. And then another girl lip, lip slide it. And that was like, that, that was the opening trick for yeah. the women. Was like, we're going to destroy this 10 stair as if it was the best trick in their run. The women have taken it to an absolutely insane level, and it's been really fun to watch over the last, I'd say, like four or five years. Yeah, I agree. Um, the level of, of skateboarding has grown, but the level of women's skateboarding yep. um, has grown by leaps and bounds yep. in every aspect of skateboarding. Yeah, Not just street, park, park um, you know, street. Hundreds, man. What is going on? You know?